ProWatt SP2000 installation video. ProWatt residential storage solution consists of PV arrays, inverter, SP2000, battery. It aims to storage the surplus energy in the daytime and to supply the load at night. Also, it is used for load shifting to improve the grid stability. Installation steps. First step, unpacking and checking. Second step, marking and drilling four holes with paperboard. Third step, mounting. Fourth step, cable connection. Fifth step, commissioning operation. Tools preparation. Unpacking and checking. Unpack the box and take out the accessories and the SP2000. According to the accessory list in the manual, check whether there is anything missing. Appearance inspection. First, to check if there is any scratch. Second, to check if the terminals are loose. Mark and drill four holes with paperboard. The thickness of the wall should be more than 60 millimeters. Unscrew the water-resistant cover of communication port. Using electric hammer to drill four holes of 8 mm diameter and 55 mm at depth. Fix the screws with hammer and unscrew the screw gap. Place SP2000 on the expansion screws and screw the screws firmly. Check and make sure SP2000 installed firmly. Cable preparation and connector assembly process. Strip one cable 8 mm on both end sides and be careful not to nick conductors. 1. Insert striped cable into female terminal and cream female terminal. 2. Insert assemble cable into female connector housing. 1. Sensor cable to the NTC and sensor port. Connect the BMS communication cable to the RS485 port. Connect the battery power cable to the charge terminal. Put back on the water-resistant cover of communication port. Connect PV array to SP2000 input terminal. Connect SP2000 output terminal to inverter input terminal. Firstly, power on SP2000 with AC plug and then turn on the DC switch of inverter. Turn on the DC switch of SP2000. At last, press the button of the battery. Wi-Fi modular is used to remote monitor the system. Unscrew the RS232 port protection cover and then place Wi-Fi modular on the RS232 port.